Hey guys, it's Orit here with Esatino Artists, and in this video, I'm going to show you how to make a YouTube banner without any need for design skills, Photoshop, anything like that. It'll be really simple. And the YouTube banner that I'm talking about, just to be clear, is this long one here at the top. So not this, which is the YouTube profile picture. So there's a tool online that you can use for free. It's called photor.com. And it, um, I'm actually going to go there through Google because that way it's easier just to take you straight to the YouTube banner maker that they have. So I'm just gonna type in google.com. And then in the search, type in YouTube banner maker. It should be the very first result at the top here. It's photor.com slash features slash youtube.html. So just click on that. And I don't even know if I'm pronouncing it right, Fotor or Foter or whatever you want to call it, but it's an amazing tool. Um, you just have to click on Get Started once you're on their site. And it's going to load the photo editor. Now the really cool thing about this is that it's already going to prepare the canvas for you in the amount of pixels that the image needs to be. So YouTube requires, has certain requirements for the image that you're uploading into the YouTube banner area and Fotor already has that ready for you. So they'll prepare that canvas for you and all you need to do is just go ahead and start designing. They already have templates that you can use and different fonts. They have cool stickers. So I'm just going to show you here to give you an example. Um, Actually, before I begin, right off the bat, you should have, I just want to say that you should have an idea in mind of what you want to design. Um, whether it's very similar to what you have on your website, you know, maybe you just wanted to upload a logo. Um, just already have an idea in mind because there are so many things you can do on here that it can get overwhelming and you can spend hours and hours in here just because there's so many cool tools that they give you. So um, just have an idea in mind. And so when you first come on here, you'll see that they have all of these templates for you to use. The templates that have this little flag at the top here, it's not free to use, but they're very inexpensive too. I think it's just, there's like, um, if you use it, they'll put a, a watermark on it that you could see here and they won't let you save it until you pay for it. And it's really inexpensive. Um, if you really like those templates, you can go ahead and purchase one of those. But there are also so many other templates that you can use for free. So what I suggest is scrolling through the templates to see what, um, uh, what sort of structure of that template works best for you. You might see a font that you really like. Um, like this one, for example, that matches your branding. And so it would be really easy for you to go ahead and customize that text and then just upload a different picture for a background. Um, or maybe you like the structure of something like, something like this where it has, um, or maybe not that one, but something like, let's just say this one where it has a nice box around it and just has a cool presentation similar to what you wanna do. And again, all you have to do is just edit the text, upload a different background. Um, so really start from that point. Wh what looks uh, quite similar to what you wanna create. I'm just gonna take you through an example here. Let's say I really like um, I really like this right here. I really love the font. I love how the the simplicity of it has a box around it. I want to create something similar for my channel. So I can go ahead and customize it directly just by clicking on the text. And let's just say I'm going to put Esatino Artists. And let's just say I, um, I don't like the spacing for the text. So I'm going to go over here and edit the font. I can reduce the spacing, just maybe make it a little bit bigger. And I can also change the alignment and the font over here as well. Um, but I like this as is. I just need to extend the box. So let's go ahead and do that, move that around. So you see here is pretty easy to use so far and um, let's just say I want to use a different image for the background. Um, so I can just remove that 
and over here is where you import photos from your computer. So just click on that. I already have an image that I want to use, so let's just say I want to use this one. And to use it, I need to click on the image and it's gonna load it on top of the canvas. Um, but you see here, I need to move it behind these um, the, the text over here. So I, this is the layers button, and it allows me to control the positioning of the photo. So you can just play around with the arrows and um, just need to move it down two layers to be behind the text here. So that's great. I can resize the photo. You see how you can really create something here in like two minutes. You just need to know what you want to do and it will be very easy um, for you to complete your YouTube banner. So there you go. Oh, whoops, I moved out of place. There you go. So let's say um, I'm happy with this. Maybe I might want to add, I'm just going to show you where they have stickers. So on the side here is a little star circle button. If you click on that, again, they have premium stickers with the diamond where you have to pay a little bit extra, or you can scroll through. They have so many free images that you can use. There's shapes, there's lines. Um, there's some cool banners that you can use. Just to show you an example, you can use any of these banners and maybe put your logo on it. Um, or they have cool little, cool little sticker type things that you can use. Again, depending on your niche, what your the the topic of your channel is. So you can play around with this for, for hours, really. Um, the best thing to do is to, to go in here and play around with it yourself. But again, keep in mind to have something, some sort of idea already of what you wanna create. It'll just make it a lot easier. My favorite part of this tool is that you can see what your banner will look like on all three mediums. So if someone's looking on your YouTube channel on um, on their laptop, on a mobile, or on a TV, you're able to see right within this tool what your banner will look like on all versions. So you don't have to create it, save it, and then upload it in YouTube and see what it looks like in their um, in their tool there. You can do it all from here. So this right here where you see the eye, it says preview. If you click on that, here is where it'll show you exactly what it looks like. So this is what it looks like on the TV. If I click over here, I can see what it looks like on the laptop. So I can, right off the bat, I can see that it's not even. So I can go back into the photo editor and move this down a little bit. Um, and this is what it looks like on mobile. So this is really one of my favorite parts um, to this design tool. So you don't have to flip back and forth between your design tool and YouTube to try and make it work. It's all over here. Once you're done, you go to um, this, this part right here where it says save. You tap on that and just give it any sort of name that you like. I usually like to save it as a, a PNG, just higher quality and then I'll go save to my computer. And that's it, you'll have the file ready to go and you can just upload that image as is onto your YouTube channel. And I'll put a link down below in the description, a link to our other video which shows you how to upload your channel art, your YouTube banner. If you need help with that, you can check that out. So that's it guys. I really invite you to go over to this website, check it out, play around with it, have fun. And let me know if you have any questions, if I can help at all. If you need help with designing your YouTube banner, um, we have a YouTube channel uh, graphics pack available as well, we'll where we'll design your, your banner, your thumbnails, and your profile picture, and give that all to you for 40 bucks. So if you need help, you know, if you're finding that this is frustrating, it's not your thing, we'd be happy to help with that. All right, so hope this video has been helpful for you guys. Give us a like and subscribe to the channel if it was, and I will see you in the next video. Ciao.